What is going on people? It's a Monday the 5th of September. I'm Matt from Liquid Loans and these are your top Pulse Chain and DeFi newsworthy updates. The market has steadied out over the past week with most of the top 20 leaning slightly back into the green. Bitcoin is sitting at $19,778, up 0.6% from the past week, and Ethereum is sitting at $1,566, up nearly 9% in the past seven days, which can be attributed to the excitement around the merge. Bitcoin starts the second week of September still trying to cement $20,000 as support as the bears are still in control. The largest cryptocurrency emerges from a sideways weekend with the weekly close almost exactly at the 20k mark but that significant psychological level is already struggling. Macroeconomic turmoil remains the name of the game in much of the world, the emphasis increasingly shifting to Europe as the energy crisis unfolds and the euro reaches 20-year lows versus the US dollar. Ethereum's native token Ether is not immune to downside risk in September, according to DeFi pundits after rallying approximately 90% from its bottom of around $880 back in June of this year. Much of the token's upside move is attributed to the merge, a technical upgrade that would make Ethereum a proof-of-stake blockchain, which is stated for the 15th of September. But despite logging impressive gains between June and September, Ethereum still sits at almost 70% below its record high of around $4,950 from November 2021. Therefore, the possibility of heading lower is still on the cards. Now, nearly everyone in DeFi is excited to see advancements in the Ethereum network, but as we all know, buy the rumor and sell the news plays out again and again, so why would this time be any different? Excitement is building as the Liquid Loans dApp on the testnet is coming very, very soon and will be available for the community to use, try out, find issues and give the Liquid Loans team any feedback they want via the anonymous ticketing system. Also, the sacrifice balances checking process closed at the end of August and all of the points are currently being recalculated and final numbers will follow shortly. So stay tuned to the Liquid Loans YouTube channel and Telegram chat to stay in the loop with all the latest developments. This has been your Pulse Chain and DeFi updates on Monday the 5th of September 2022. If you like content like this, do hit that subscribe button and that bell icon so you're notified every time we drop new videos. Thanks for watching and I will see you on the next one.